I think uh, probably the story of the day was the energy in the nap center. I mean, it was it was hot out there. I shouldn't have worn my turtleneck, <laughs> uh, but it was uh, you know it was it was awesome. I mean, there was there was buzz. Our fans were there. We had a lot of different communities from a lot of our players come in town. Uh, but just a really really fun day full of. Uh, there's just a ton of energy, and then I and then I think we played a pretty good game too. And um, it was a really fun team win. What's really fun about it is, you know, you start to reflect about how many games we've had that every player on our team has scored. And I think that's what's. It's just a testament to to every member on our team. I think we had to adjust a lot in the first half. They had a good game plan, so we had to be able to adjust on the fly. And I think our players did that. Um, but we really played well together today. And I thought. You know, I thought Becca Jonas did a really nice job of being able to establish in the paint on both ends and be able to communicate. And I thought Caitlin just read the game perfectly today. I thought she shot when she should have shot. She passed when she should have passed. But she just created a flow today that was um, that was really fun for them to play in and, and, and one to definitely fun to coach and definitely fun to watch. Do you have questions when you guys are ready? I guess, Coach, just um, what's it mean to you to get the um, the win streak, that, the best win streak for um, or best start for a Valley team that's kind of special? You know, I, I do think it's special, and I and I don't want to overlook that because I do think it's it's one of the many things this team has done. Um, but I think what's even more special is that you no, know, we didn't set out on a mission to do anything other than continue to focus on getting better and having fun doing it. And I think you got to see a team do that. I think you got to see it this entire weekend. It was fantastic to be at home. Um, they had so much fun playing. It was it was just a, a really fun weekend, and I think now we know that we need to continue to just be in that space and play and play. And and if the records come, they come, and if they don't, they don't. And it really doesn't matter. We're just going to continue to focus on on getting better and having fun. Can you look at how this team's playing? One argument can be said, you know, this part of the schedule, you guys are expected to win this, but it just seems like these last couple games, balance-wise, this team has taken it to a new level as a coach. Does that maybe mean more than anything else? The fact that I mean, obviously your stars are going to get their moments, but it seems like you know one through ten, you guys are getting just great effort each night. Well, I think you're exactly right, and I think that um, probably the biggest thing that this this weekend really you know really showed us as a coaching staff was our tempo and our intensity. I thought was consistent throughout, and um, especially this time of year. This is separation time, you know, and it's time that the people can get their belief. It's time that people can kind of go down. But this team is is really strengthening their belief in, in each other. And you can see it. You can see it in their energy. You can see it on both ends of the floor. I don't think it's one end over the other. Um, I think that's one thing. I think the other thing that's really impressive is when you start to talk about the depth, it's never mattered about the scoreboard. Our uh, We don't have, our bench doesn't come in to just keep everything steady or when we're up by a lot. Our bench comes in regardless of what the score is and we play a lot of people regardless of what the score is. So for us to be able to do what we've done at the beginning of the year because of that, I think you're starting to see that now. Hey, did you like during the game when it was clearly <coughs> out of hand you were going to win, it seemed like your team was even more committed to executing? Trying to get better that way? I think we have to continue to focus on getting better because when you start talking about the mission that we're on, that's the mission we're on is to get better every day. And so we have to get better every day. It doesn't matter if you're in practice. It doesn't matter if you're in a game. It doesn't matter if you're up in a game, down in a game, if it's a really close game and it's an overtime. I mean, it doesn't, it, it hasn't really mattered um, because we are hungry to just get better. Nobody's satisfied where we're at, um, nobody thinks we've arrived. Um, we probably make sure that we all know that we haven't arrived <laughs> probably every day. We all get a little bit humbled. Um, but we also, we also want to enjoy what we're doing. And I think there's, there's a fine line in there, but, um, but it's one that we're going to keep searching for. I guess for the players, what was the key to kind of getting going today? And especially second quarter, what did you guys turn it to a new level in that second quarter really got up, kind of up a pretty big? Yeah, um, I think we just continued to move the ball well, and we picked up de defensively. Um, worked on our rotations and communicating more. And then um, on offense, we just kept running and pushing in transition and really looked to set each other up. And that's what works for us. So. I just thought we did a great job of setting our tempo, even though they were trying to slow the game down. Um, we did a great job of adjusting and just having fun and playing the game. It helps when you can pass like that, though, too, doesn't it? <laughs> it kind of gets a little energy sometimes. <laughs> You guys talk about, I mean, every every game you guys are trying to improve and get better. 
I mean, 13 to 0 in the Valley, 14 game winning streak. How much higher can this team possibly go? Um, we're just taking it one day at a time. I think that's the biggest lesson this team's learned, and we're just having fun doing it. I think you can tell by watching us. Um, we're having fun, and we're having, you know, it's fun to watch. So I think that's just that's the goal, and the byproduct is winning. So I guess we'll see how much further we'll go. Yeah, we got a lot of time left to find out, which is fun. It's really cool.